What's good you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hey what's up love? I'm Kay and if you've been here before, thank you so much for stopping back by. Alright, so today I'm going to be doing a video that I actually did not plan on doing but after my style with me, quite a few people were like, dude, can you please do a video where you just recommend vendors because I do understand that even after my AliExpress video, Buying online can just be super daunting and you do want to make sure that you're just putting your money where you'll actually get what you paid for and will not be disappointed. So I decided that you know what, let's do a little chit chat. Let me just come through and talk to you guys real quick about the vendors that I personally use, that I personally trust and that sell stuff that is along my personal taste because that's the only thing that I can really recommend. So without any further ado, let's hop straight into it if you're not part of the family, girl. Please subscribe down below and also let me know if you like this video by liking and subscribing and also following me on Instagram. I'm at Care Public absolutely everywhere. So yeah, without any further ado, let's hop straight into it. Make him whistle like a missile. Bum, bum. Every time I show up, blow up. Uh. Alright, so let me hop onto my phone and let me actually go onto my AliExpress. So I don't know if you guys know, but AliExpress kind of has a feature where you can follow certain vendors and certain stores. The reason is AliExpress is so big, you don't want to actually lose somebody that you saw something that you like. Sometimes putting something on your wish list is not enough. You actually do want to just save the store so that you can go back later. So I'm going to go on to, firstly, I'm going to go on to the people that I follow. And then I'm going to show you guys also the people that I've bought from that I might not necessarily be following. But I did actually buy something and it did get to me. So the first one that I'm going to go into is some store called, they do kind of have weird days, I'm not going to lie. They are obviously like, you know, Chinese uh, stores, so they don't necessarily like name their things according to what will be easy for us to say or whatever. I don't think they care. So um, it's NLWS Chris Storm and they've got some cute stuff. They have very uh, chill muted they kind of have like a cotton on type of vibe and they have great prices as well they've got clothes and accessories they don't necessarily sell shoes and then the second store that i recommend is a store called vadim i actually have something from them i have a suit from them that i bought they have like a very zara aesthetic so they've got very chill stuff very you know, literally the reason why I'm saying I'm comparing them to Zara is because the suit that I bought was the Zara suit, so the yellow suit that everybody got from Zara. They literally sold and I got it for like a fraction of the cost. I'll post it scene on Instagram, so follow me if you want to see it. And then another is Missy Chili. Uh, they have very bad bitch instagram type of clothes but not the not the fashion over bad bitch but kind of like the i don't know how to they have very bad bitch instagram aesthetic type of clothing and yeah i love i love them and then another one is okay I don't know how to say these names so another one is actually where i got my black pointed black sandal strappy shoes and it's a shoe store called itarata it itarata itarata is official store. <laughs> they have very nice stuff guys it's just that not everything is like my style but they do have very nice stuff they've got boots right now obviously because that side of the world is getting colder but it's super cute stuff if you're looking for the heels that i had then you can definitely go on there and yeah and then another one is love and lemonade and the best way for me to describe love and lemonade is house of cb they have like bad bitch like hi you know how house of cbs has like that hello aesthetic they have the same it's like if i'm looking for something for an event that's not too close by because it is aliexpress i would go on love, love and lemonade because they've just got like very nice pieces for like evening wear and stuff like that and then another cute little baddie, like super cute type of 
store is one actually such a weird name but it's called new asia garden store i don't know why because they sell clothing but yeah new asia they have very nice stuff very baddie like body con bright colors plunging necklines off the shoulder bodysuit stuff like that and then another store that kind of reminds me of like boohoo or kind of like house of cbs is one called fantoye official store fantoye official store has like that same baddie vibe but it, it's just got the more relatable aspects of like boohoo and i like that about them I and mean, this was super funny when I found the name, but I absolutely love them. This is something different. It's not necessarily clothes. They sell like home decor and stuff like that. It's called Organized Store. And I followed them because they said they're organized and I love that. I just want, you know, people that know their shit. And they sell very at home stuff. If if you guys like maybe shopping at, at home or like you like the modern aesthetic then you'll really like organized store because they've got like very nordic stuff scandinavian stuff that's very much their aesthetic and then if you watched my trends video if you watched my summer trends video and you heard me talk about Salix O and you went ahead and you followed her or whatever and you you vibe with her and her little extra you know bad bitch expensive vibe then you'll like I don't know how to say this word. I re I'm just going to put it on the screen. But it's what like Princess Storm. They have very... They sell shoes. But it's like extra. It's like Salix O Extra. Um, but yeah. It's stuff that you... I genuinely would not buy absolutely everything from him. But I can tell that they do a lot of designer dupes. Like I'm literally seeing a Jacquemus dupe right here. I see a Prada. I see a Chanel dupe. But it's a dupe. It's not necessarily a replica. So it's not stuff that looks identical. And it's not stuff that claims to be that brand it's just a dupe and then something that sells if you know brandy melville then you'll know bradley mitch okay you won't know it but you'll get the vibe bradley michelle has they sell like very basic like you know bicycle shorts crop tops stuff like that loungewear looking stuff they sell stuff like that and it's also very chill very cute nothing crazy that's the type of vibe that they have and yeah it's not the cheapest but i do actually own a little mock neck sweater and i do want to just say that they have high quality so maybe that's why their prices are not the cheapest but they're not like crazy expensive you know and then there is this stock this store called less verage less verage official store i can't say i can't say it i'm so sorry guys but they have like very whimsical on trend stuff but it's like very whimsical very ethereal very you know chill and i love the fact that they sell a lot of things in pastels it's also very house of cb but it's like a little more whimsical than house of cb not necessarily baddie but not grandma then there's a store called two twin style and they have like pieces they have pieces i love their stuff i feel like you'd honestly i'd wear some of the stuff to fashion week i'd even wear some of the stuff to paris fashion week like it's that nice like it's such nice stuff um the prices are a bit up there i'm not gonna lie but i do feel like it's worth it because you're getting pieces that are like very very nice like i'm just looking at the aesthetic right here it is very like you know some of the stuff is just way too out there but some of the stuff is actually actually very nice so for jewelry guys i like very you know nice pieces like this you know stuff that's different like i've got a whole gun right over here and i got this from shein shein is on aliexpress and they had the fastest delivery i've ever experienced like it literally came in like a week and a half and that's very unusual and then another store that i got jewelry from is a store called joy 100 store and they've got like very nice asymmetrical very cute jewelry that you can check out and then for phone cases and stuff i got this phone case from aliexpress and i got it from a store called qpyi mobile phone accessory store i'll also have that in the description box and they delivered very nicely for makeup brushes and stuff like that i've bought 
makeup brushes a set of makeup brushes from aliexpress and i used a store called betty list official store and they have nice stuff as well and then for the crop tops you know the little stringy crop tops that i wear all the time i want to actually tell you the official store that i used and the fucking name is so fucking funny let me show you it's literally one two three exclamation point exclamation point exclamation point store that's the name of the store and I got all of my little crop tops from there and then the one that I'm wearing right now I got from a store called ooh ooh ooh, ooh. I'll put that on the screen and I'll link it down below because I'm not about to bite my fucking tongue and then my white heels my, I told you guys where I got my black heels and then the white heels that I have I got from a store called Hang Scaring Hangs, hang scare, hang scaring official store. <laughs> I got it from there. I got it from a store called that. And I then told you guys about my black shoes. Oh, another shoe store that I absolutely love because they have the trendiest shoes ever is a store called Anike Anike Two Store. But yeah. That's basically what I got, what I've gotten before, what I, who I follow on uh, AliExpress, and I feel like that's a good amount, that's a good chunk of vendors for you guys to just check out. I've got all the links down below, and I think I did include on the sides, just like their aesthetic and their vibe. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know a lot of people just like really want to be safe and whatever, so start with these stores and then explore AliExpress as you get into it. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys in our next video.